Welcome back. To a little hope. Today we will start. Start chapter two. The next story. <coughs> oh. Hey, Taylor, help me get Andrew up on his feet, will ya? Wait, I don't remember anything. Who are you? It's okay. Mm. You're concussed. I'm John. You're a college professor. <coughs> we were taking a bus on a field trip, but that didn't work out so well. Crash wasn't on the curriculum. <laughs> uh, we'll find the others, get some help. Think of it as a character building exercise. <sighs> Come on, you can do it. <sighs> Teamwork at its finest. I had this dream. It was so real. Flames all around us. It was grim. That bang on the head must have been a beauty. That trail the others are on will come out down the road. We'll meet them there. Oh, God. I don't think leaving the bus is smart. I'm staying here. You can't stay. No one's been down this road since we crashed. No one knows we're here. You got something to prove here? And who put you in charge anyway? What is your problem? I get that you're the professor here, but that doesn't mean you can tell us what to do. I never saw you step up when there was a problem at college, Mr. Low Profile. The driver's done what we should be doing. Gone into town for help. I will say nothing. Okay. Wait here all night then. I'll go myself. Hey, Professor! He How is about, a professor, right? How about me? I'm still fuzzy. Can we stick together? I don't want to wait on my own. I guess he's right. We should all stick together. I got no signal either. Must be some kind of black spot. Or you didn't pay your last bill. You get that during the crash? <sighs> I guess so. No, but... Oh. Okay. I crawled up the professor's ass. I don't I know. Show him a little more respect. He thinks he's smarter than us, but book smart is no good out here. Oh, no. He's all up himself, acting like the big man on campus. Oh, okay. Good this place? No. Little Hope? No. I mean, I don't think so. You should both know Little Hope. Why? Seriously, this place is steeped in history. Fascinating stuff. Why? How do you know all this stuff anyway? <laughs> I'm a professional academic. I read books, unlike some. 
Easy, Einstein. I can match everything you got with just a smartphone. Well, your phone isn't so smart without a signal. Oh, don't tell me you're on his side. Oh, no. What? Good to see you two. Finally. Everything okay? Sure. We took the scenic route. You sure as hell took your own sweet time. Just getting worried. I bet you were. This gate is chained. We can't get through. Look around. See if there's anything we can use to break it. Why? Think this'll do it? Yeah. Ready? I'll push hard from my side. Ready. Three, two, one, push. <laughs> Fucking thing. Holding out good for a rusty chain. Let's give it another go. Two, one, push. Step aside for some girl power. Girl power? It's almost huh? open. Don't fret. We'll finish the job even if you couldn't. Are you ready? Huh. On my mark. Three, two, one, now! Like I said, we were almost there. Sure you were. Girl power. What's the plan now? I already said I want to wait at the bus for help. Not head into town like John wants. And we've already concluded this conversation. Not with everyone here, we didn't. We should vote on it. No need for a vote. Decisions made. I'm sorry, but we really don't have time to be arguing. You'll stay here with me, won't you? Uh. Looks like he ain't so keen after all. If you got something to say to me, spit it out. John's right. Heading into town is our quickest way to find help. Satisfied? No. Sure. Whatever you say. Try to be civil. Cost nothing. That's rich, given how you badmouth Taylor on the way over. What did she say about me? You always get your boyfriend to stick up for you? Try doing it yourself sometime, dear. Well, that certainly shut you up. Quit it, will you? The last thing we need is you causing trouble. Keep out of our business, okay? We are wasting valuable time here. Can we please just keep moving? I'm still not sure heading into town is such a great idea. I'm going to hang out by the bus while you all do whatever you have to. You want to come along and wait with me? Okay. Mm, no worries. I still think the smart move is for us all to stick together. You'll be glad we didn't stick together after we flagged down a car and come rescue your ass. Huh. You get lost? No. Back here? This doesn't add up. This is some very weird shit going on here. Spare us all. First he loses his pride, then he loses his way. What are you trying to say? That you've lost it. It's not possible. Look, I don't know what you're trying to prove here, but we've got better things to do. Daniel? Whoa. Hey, careful! Watch out! Quit fucking around and tell me what's going on here. The two of us will go together. This is getting ridiculous. Indulge me. right we walked dead straight going away from you so how'd we end up back here I don't know okay let's try something we'll all go together we came from that direction we must be able to go back that way yeah I want everyone to stay real close no stragglers okay you put us on a kid's line okay okay I'm coming 
I admit, that is a little odd. More than a little. See? What did I tell you? It's just like I've been saying, we are trapped! We can't leave here! Now okay. what can we do? Okay, calm down, breathe. There's a rational explanation for what's happening. Maybe we all died in the crash. Yeah, nice theory, but I'm pretty sure we're all still alive and kicking. Last I checked, you were schooling us on creative writing, not metaphysics. I know who I'd like to be kicking. This is all down to you, this pissy little field trip. Now we're stuck here in little no hope. That is way out of line. I had no way of knowing that damn bus I would heard crash. The voice you can on me. Yeah, Are no. you for fucking real? Watch your tone, will you? I am doing my best to understand this, just like you and the rest of us. I'm sorry. I don't get what's happening to us. I don't understand. It's like you said, we're trapped in a nightmare. It's okay. We're gonna be just fine. We'll figure no, a way not. out of this together. Someone else thinks they can do a better job? Step right up. Maybe it isn't real. We have to get out of here. I, I hate need to the voices. Why the fuck? Can everyone just shut up? This isn't helping us find help or getting us out of here. He's right. Bitching at each other isn't getting us anywhere. We have to work together as a team. Thank you. Yeah. Now let's be logical. Yeah. The fog is between us and the bus. Yeah. There is no fog between us and town, so let's head that way. Yeah. I don't get how heading further away from the bus helps. There is nothing on the bus we can use to get help. In town, there will be people, a working phone, something. It pains me to admit, but he's right. There is nowhere else we can go except into that damn town. Sounds like a plan to me. I don't need help. Where are you going? Come on, let's go with them. Until we know what's up, we should stick together. How'd you get that bruise? No biggie. Must have got it when the bus crashed. There you go. Why did you say we might all be dead? You really think that's possible? I saw some cable show about how your brain keeps going for a while after you... You know. You die? Forget about it. What they said didn't really stack up. I don't like the look of that place at all. Maybe they won't ask for ID. Where are we going? Oh. Killer, is it? Is it? Is this the dog? I'm not sure this is such a great idea. We should check it out. There could be a phone inside. I'll go in and take a look around. Go ahead. We'll be right behind you. Why aren't we going with those guys? Angela knows there's something between us. That's obvious. We're really going to get into this now? Like we've got no other bigger shit to deal with tonight? This is a big deal. For me, anyhow. I'm telling you, Angela is onto us. She knows. What did you two talk about? She was digging around like she always does. What exactly did you tell her back there? Relax. I said nothing about us. I'm not ready to go public about us yet. I will be soon, I promise. Anything I can do to help convince you I'm the right guy? Mm. I need Whatever. to know 100% I can rely on you. Whatever. We should catch up with the others. We standing here all night or we going inside?
Hi there. How you doing? Hello. Excuse me, but we're uh, looking for our bus driver. What? Have you seen him? <laughs> yeah, that's funny. What is? What's up with the fog outside? It's pretty weird. Yeah, it sure is a thick one tonight. So thick it's stopping us from leaving. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I know that feeling. You mean you're trapped uh, Sorry too? for busting in like this. Uh, bus we were on crashed a little way back up the road there. We're still a little shaken up. We're still a lot shaken up. You certainly look shook up. I'm Vince. I need a mirror. Maybe there's one here not covered in 20 years of... Sounds like you could use a drink. Better not, thanks. I need to keep a clear head. <clears throat> it's right there if you change your mind. Not for me. Why are you even here? Little Hope sure isn't the town it used to be. What are you doing in here alone? I'm sure you have a good reason to be here. Right? Yeah, I got my reasons for being here. What? You want to tell us about it? Not the sharing type. Do I look like I'm a big talker? Let's just leave him be. There's all kinds in this place. <laughs> what is this guy's problem? There's definitely something off about him. <laughs> Uh, he's harmless. Just had one too many. Let's look around. There must be something here that can help us. See what you can dig up. Uh, he's in a world of his own. An old darts board. I was pretty good back in the day. Stay. Play a little, no problem. I'm gonna take a look around. Just a quick throw, and then we'll figure out how we're getting out of here. Try for a big double. Or... Not my first time, Daniel. Shooting for double 20. Okay, so you can play a little. Still got it. Now for triple 20. Well, almost an Olympic shot after the night we've had. They don't play darts in the Olympics. <laughs> that is one <laughs> hell of a shot. <laughs> you did better than Taylor. Let's get back to why we came in here. Here want to talk. Want to talk, man. Hey, you want to talk? <clears throat> what? Got anything else for us on Little Hope? Uh, booze gone in my head. You okay? I'm sure it's just one too many. We both had better days. Some free advice. Lay off the drink. Take it easy, will ya? Sure thing. <laughs> Gotta keep a clear head, right? Fuck. 
No, that one. Hello. Hello. This place has some great history. I thought it was spiritual ghost. Wow. I can't believe it. These guys could be relatives. Hey, this way. Let's get out of here and... And what? You all hear that? Yeah. I definitely heard something. Did... You hear that as well? Yeah. Come on. Whatever it was, came from outside. You really think it's smart to go back outside? Well, there's nothing for us here. We need to move on. Best of luck. Hope you find what you're looking for. How you die out, Titan? Wait with that, Titan. It's coming from the town. Did the old fucker just lock us out? He was weird, that old guy. Sure was something off about him. I come to Creepy Central just to get a top up. What does that mean? Oh, what? feeling about this we'll figure it out the way this fog just appears it's not natural can you two make an effort to keep up Can you come over here? What's wrong? I just saw someone in the woods. I can't see anyone. Will you two get a move on? I know what I saw. Sorry, I don't buy it. Nobody would be out here at this ungodly hour. Okay. We really should catch up with the others. You two. We need to stick close. What the hell? Did you hear that? What on earth is that? Okay, very good. We're freaked. Who's there? Whoever you are, this isn't funny at all. John, where are you? Daniel, Taylor? Come on, John, where are you? This isn't funny.
Hey, wait for us. What is that? What? There is something very weird about this fog. Stay close. Uh, what? Where are we going? I'm wondering if the fog wants to keep us here. Don't let us leave. We're gonna go this way. Then. Hey. Uh, Come and check this out. What on earth is that? Not a clue. It's a doll. It's a. It's a res res doll. I think. Oh my god! Uh. <laughs> what is your name, sir? Huh? <laughs> oh my god! Uh. Yeah. Uh. Um, Andrew? Andrew? Yeah. And your name, lady? Who the hell are you? Angela. Why are you dressed like that? I did. I am called Mary. I fashioned her with my own hand. She looks I just like the one beside you. <laughs> Would you kindly come play with me? No. Come play. Come play with what me. What much trickery is this now, Mary? I have done nothing. Hold your tongue. I say, you truly are, Mary. Reverend Carver's affection for you will be shaken loose when he learns of your infidelity with the devil. Amen. Amen. Come back here. There's someone else out here by the fire. What? I, I don't see any fire. I will. I will. I saw them too. Oh my God. How can you not have seen that? I couldn't see anything through this impossible, impenetrable fog. Well, go ahead. Tell them what we saw. A little girl appeared out of the fog, and then just like that, she was gone again. What is going on? Maybe the fog has got you confused. Okay, I will. Oh my god. I will see you guys on the next episode. Yeah.